Hey guys, Long Nair, welcome back to New Video Now today. Today we're going to be going to a big game, Tottenham versus Bournemouth. There's only a one point difference between the two teams, which I find mad. Tottenham are in 10th place, Bournemouth are in 11th. This is Mourinho's first home Premier League game. What's your score prediction, Dad? What are you going for? Um, it's all Tottenham today. I'm going for 3-0. 3-0 Tottenham. I'm going to say... 3-1 Tottenham, I think Bournemouth will nick one because Mourinho will sort out the defence but it won't happen straight away. Mourinho's going to have a good effect on the club I think. I think he was the right decision. Let's go to Seven Sisters, let's go to the football and let's see what happens. Lovely day for the footy today, can't complain. George here, Tottenham fan. What's your score prediction today? Uh, I'm going for a 3 0 win to Spurs. 3 0 win Spurs, yeah? Who's getting the goals, you reckon? I reckon uh, Frank Kane will get a couple. Yeah. Son, Son will get the other one, I reckon. Yeah. What do you think? <laughs> what do you think Mourinho's going to do it for your club? Where do you think you're going to finish? And do you think trophies will finally come to Tottenham Hotspur? I reckon we'll, I reckon we'll get. I'm not sure about this season, but sometime next season. I think we'll yeah. get a cup like the FA Cup or the League Cup, maybe. Yeah. Oh, we've got Jasher here. Uh, you, you, you would have recognised him from my previous Tottenham vlogs last year. Um, but obviously, we're back here today, and obviously, the big news is Mourinho has been hired. Pochettino has been sacked. First of all, when you heard the Poch news of him being sacked, were you annoyed, surprised, angry? I, I was annoyed. He's done so much for our club. Yeah. Uh, it, we need a change. Yeah. It was, it was the right time, and you can't get a better manager than Mourinho. Do you think Deli Alli's going to be back to the play he was yeah, before he's under Mourinho? Yeah, he's been good, hasn't he? He's already scored, he's already got two assists now. Harry Kane as well. Exactly. Yeah. So, yeah. The players are looking up for it. Defensively, we're still not there. So I, I, can't see, I can't see us keeping a clean sheet just yet today. Yeah, 3 1 you go for, 3 1 score prediction. I went for the same actually, yeah. So what's your score prediction today? I think the score will be uh, 3 0. No. We've got Jeff and Jude here, Spurs fans, I'm guessing, yeah? Yes, Spurs fans love that. And what's your score prediction today? I'm saying 3 1 Spurs today. 3 1 Spurs? Yeah. yeah. Confident? 4 0, even more confident. What do you think Mourinho is going to do to this club? Hopefully, as everyone keeps saying, win something. Yeah. Win a trophy, but yeah. at the end of the day, I feel, feel sorry for Poch, but I think Mourinho will come in and, and probably maybe give that winning mentality to yeah. the side. We've got Max here, Tottenham fan. What's his score prediction today? 3-1 uh, right. Tottenham. Three, one Tottenham. <laughs> here we are, the beautiful Tottenham Hotspur new stadium. You liking the new stadium then? It's incredible. I mean, yeah. as you walk in, you see all the old shops and old houses. It's yeah. like the stadium is just risen out of yeah. the ground. It's beautiful, it's just isn't it? incredible. And it begins here. Spurs are the best chance of the game here so far. Jung Min Sun hits it. Just wide, but what a player Jung Min Sun is. Made the run, created the chance for himself. Dad? Great play from Delhi, from Harry, from Song. Superb. Yeah, their front three. All looking good so far. Yeah! There we go. Tottenham 1 0. Easy as you like. Jung Min Sun to Delhi Alley. They enjoyed that. And within 20 minutes, it's already 1 0 to Tottenham. They took their chance, didn't they? That is beautiful football. Yeah. So Delhi Alley, one. Easy footing. 1-0. Brilliant. Oh, Harry Kane nearly making it two. Bang. Oh, brilliant. Oh, yeah! 2-0. Easy as you like. Uh, VAR. VAR. Oh no, offside disallowed. It's disallowed. Second goal. Typical, isn't it? Brilliant. Half time here at Tottenham Oxford's new ground. Decent half. Tottenham being on top. Right, Thog Dad, we're here at the yeah. new White Hot Lane. You're here for the first time. And when yeah. I told you the news, it's got a brewery here. You were very surprised, weren't you? I was uh, pleasantly surprised. <laughs> I've got one complaint about this new ground. Yeah. You run out of veggie pies by half time. I oh, Scotland, so shocking. Levy, have a word. But I'm going for the neck oil. Yeah. Which is brewed on site. So Love. Top Love. Hot spur neck oil. Give it a go. One of the only stadiums in England, I think the only stadium where you brew your beer 
in the stadium. Give it a review. What's it getting? Surprisingly nice. That is one of the nicest pints I've ever had at a football ground. Seriously? Beautiful. What's, what's it getting? I'm giving it 7.5. Ooh! So it's Togden, pie review. Pie review, half time pie review, chicken tikka pie, at the top of the Oxford New Ground. Let's give it a go. Wow. The crust is really nice. The chicken tikka sauce that goes with the meat. The meat is crust. I'm going to give it a 7.8 out of 10. Wow. Double decent. <laughs> I've never missed a goal, and it's my first time ever. I went to the toilet and I missed a goal. Deli Ali scored a second. Well done, Deli Ali. He looks a different player under Jose Mourinho, that is one thing. He scored against Olympiacos, he got his second here today. That's what happens when you have a beer at half time, you need a piss. Of a beer review, yeah. so. When you have a beer at half time, you need a piss. When you need a piss, you miss the goal. Yeah. It's a bad, bad circle. Well, I'll tell you what, a few fancy Premier League managers are going to be buying Deli Ali now. I'm quite right. Yeah, quite rightly. Deli Ali for a hat trick! How do you miss that? I just don't think you understand. It's not Bang! Arsenal stand up! If you ain't Arsenal stand up! If you ain't Arsenal stand up! If you ain't Arsenal stand up! Here comes Son down the left wing. Oh, yeah. Just sit in. 3-0! Beautiful football! Absolutely brilliant! And the fans go wild. That is beautiful football. Brilliant, brilliant. Kuminson, Deli Ali, everyone in the attack line. Harry Kane's been quality today. Sissoko, just so good from everyone at Tottenham today. 3-0, Bournemouth are done for. And Sissoko was the goal scorer for this one. Brilliant. Amazing. Young Min Sun whipped it in. The ball went into the box. And Sissoko finishes it. Brilliant. 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 What a quality free kick there. Just quality from the number 22 for Bournemouth. And it's 3 1. Guess who predicted 3 1? I did. Tottenham 3, Bournemouth 1. My prediction is probably going to be right, isn't it? There's more goals to come. 4 or 5 1. Go on, Sun. Sun's got a chance to make it 4. Oh my god. Danny Ali today has been incredible. This could be his hat trick goal. It's saved. Son! Son to score. Oh, Son. Son's coming off. He's had a really good game. Two assists. Should have scored as well. Another good game. Another player that seems to be thriving under Jose Mourinho. It's all kicking off. It's all kicking off. It is all kicking off there. Wow. I'm not buying any Tottenham defenders yet for my fancy team. Why is that? It's, Why is that? It just looks a bit leaky at the back. Yeah. Standing ovation for Deli Ali. Deli Ali's had a great game. Unlucky not to get a hat trick. But oh my gosh. Mourinho has really turned him into top ballers. You won't believe it. Bournemouth have scored. It's 3 2. Uh, it's actually 3 2. I've got to say, Eddie Howe has got their Bournemouth team like mentality to keep going and keep going. Even when you're 3-1 down with five minutes to go, you keep going. So Eddie Howe, top manager. They checked the AR, but it's still been given. 3-2. Oh my god, you don't believe this. Bournemouth are in. Oh my god. I don't want, I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on. Am I watching the right sport here? Bournemouth nearly had they had a one-on-one -on -one chance to make it 3-3. <laughs> Never over till it's over. Exactly. Spurs keep the ball out after 3-2, expecting the whistle to go. Next thing you know, Bournemouth have a one-on-one. -on -one. Mad. There it is. There it is. Full time. The three points go to Tottenham. Yeah. What a game for Luch. What a game. What a game. Love it. I certainly did, and it was nice to actually see a Deli Ali that cares about playing football again. You know, I remember how good he was when he first entered the Premier League with Spurs, and I feel like there's that little bit more passion now uh, under Mourinho, which is great to see. Obviously, Deli Ali and Hyungman Sun got the goals and the assists, and they were classed together. The, I mean, the whole front line was really good, but obviously Mourinho will talk about in his press conference how he should have been defending better and going to cut, cut out the late goals, because we all know Mourinho is a defensive style-minded manager and in this weird transition period between Poch and Mourinho um, I think there's gonna be some leak of leakage of goals which has happened today and at West Ham they've got to find a way of blocking out those stupid goals at the end but 
Tottenham, man, they're becoming a top team. And I said to my mates on the group chat that they're going to finish top four. I said, as soon as Mourinho came in, I was like, Tottenham are going to finish top four this season. All of my mates were like, nah, no way. We'll see what happens. Thank you for watching. See you all later.